In this problem, we want to find the mass of air in the displayed room, which has a base of 4 meters, a width of 3 meters, and a height of 2 meters. This room is at standard temperature and pressure, which is 101,325 pascals, and a temperature of 20 degrees Celsius. This room is filled with air with a gas constant of 287.05 joules per kilogram degree Kelvin. We will be using a variant of the ideal gas law equation, which is PV equals MRT, which stands for the absolute pressure, which is the gauge pressure plus atmospheric pressure in pascals, times the volume in meters cubed equals the mass, which is in kilograms, times the gas constant, which is different than the PV equals NRT moles form of the equation, and the absolute temperature, which is in Kelvin. Warning, be careful to use the appropriate SI units also, you might get marked down for using the short-cutted version of the ideal gas law with mass instead of the moles of a substance. To start off, we need to arrange the ideal gas law to get what we are solving for, mass to one side. Now we must find the values in the correct units to solve this equation. The pressure is zero pascals gauge, or only atmospheric pressure, and is already in pascals, so we do not need to do anything with pressure. To find the volume, we must plug our dimensions into the area of a cube formula of base times width times height. We get an area of 24 meters cubed volume of air. We are using the gas constant shortcutted for the mass version of the ideal gas law, so we don't have to do any changes to the gas constant. To get the temperature to the correct unit of Kelvin, we can add 273.15 to the Celsius measurement of 20 degrees. We get a temperature in Kelvin of 293.15 degrees Kelvin. Now we have all of our values and we can plug our values into the displayed equation. Pressing the energy on our calculator, we get a mass of 28.9 kilograms of air. That concludes this video. Hope you have earned a like, share, or subscription. If you enjoyed this video, you may enjoy one of these videos as well. Let me know how I'm doing in the comments down below. Thank you for watching.